Hi, and welcome back to our channel. This is Scott Dallas at South Georgia Bassin. And today we have a mega, and I mean mega, a mega unboxing. This is not even on. Mega. Oh wait, let's see if we can get them on. Mega unboxing and <laughs> a rod unboxing. We're gonna try to do all this at once because you know what? I'm ready to fish with all this. six cents well, let's get into it this is like this really is like Christmas because I ordered all of this stuff some of this stuff when it first came out in stock and now it's probably all out uh, I can't even remember what it all is so this will be fun for all of us first one I, uh, uh, I remember this night I was watching uh, JR Justin Royal uh, on YouTube. His link's on my site. Go check him out. Fun, fun fishing to watch. He's out in Texas. Uh, some great fishing tips and I guarantee you some entertaining video. I'll have a link down in the right above the comment section to his site. Show him some love. Great guy. Uh, he's been burning it up on the Crush 50, which is his favorite allure. Uh, this is not a particular one, but I'm sure it's in here somewhere. These are, this is the silent version of Six Cents Crush 50. If you check that out, I'll whip it out. These are some of the new colors they just came out with and some of the ones they already had. Uh, this is the Crackle Crawl. Look at that bait. <laughs> I don't know if you can see all that. It's got orange on the bottom, blue on the top, red on the side with the stripes, realistic 3D gills, that emerald eye. They got good nickel plated hooks. I mean, I can't wait to get on the water and try that. I'm gonna try to, uh, we got so much opening up here, I'm not gonna be able to take each one out because this video would be an hour long and I don't think some of you folks would hang around that long to watch an old man opening lures but I did want you to see some of the, the new colors um, this is a, a different variation this is the bold crawfish uh, goodness gracious I think I got like two of each this is the crimson crawl it's more of a red. These are all in the Crush 50. This whole box is Crush 50. Justin got me fired up. <laughs> and you can go on his site, by the way, if you want to order some of this six cent stuff. He's got a JR10 code. You can apply at checkout and get 10% off your entire order. Uh, and then everything over $50 is free shipping. So. You can get on there and save some bucks and go to his channel and get entertained uh, and get some tips. But, I mean, Rambo Red. Can't put, I can't wait to get the old Rambo out there. Uh, I mean, just new colors. Uh, this is the Crawl Bomb. It's got a little more of a sparkly. 
that's also in the crush 50. I mean, <laughs> the I got some awesome color. It's it's cranking season. It's cranking season. Check them out. I can't even get them all in the picture. Let's try. Bass feeding out there. Awesome colors. Another red. This one is a crawfish nook. Let's take that one out and look at it. That's, that's got more of a natural. Got a little bit of orange, some gold on the side, some violet, purple on the rear. Good looking bait. Put that back in there. Like I said, I don't take them all out because we got so many boxes here to open up. To get caught up, I just thought I'd try to do it all in uh, one video. I keep seeing fish right here in the little boathouse lake chasing bait fish. <laughs> um, let's see. This is one of the new colors. Tiger Truce. Now all these, this is in the silent version. Uh, all these, the, the Crush 50 runs two to five feet. So it makes a great shallow water. Oh, and for those of you who have uh, rock bottoms and rock beds, now, don't have them here where we fish in South Georgia, but uh, I bust this through some, you know, some lily pads that are kind of thinned out, some grass edges uh, right up on the bank. You can throw it right up on the bank. Uh, Tap it a few times slow and then start cranking down as the water gets deeper. Excellent bait. I like the silent. Uh, this is the silent version. I like the silent to try with the silent baits first. I'm not getting any reaction because everybody throws a bait. This is the same crackle crawl in a, a silent version as well. So I try to get the colors that do good in a silent version because um, those don't have it. The regular crush has got a couple uh, got a couple of beads in it. So um, I showed you that color. That's the crimson crawl. This color I didn't have. These two colors I didn't have. Uh, I got one in the silent. Uh, you know the bone reactor, which I have on the catwalk. Uh, I've got it in the crush silent. I want to give that a try as well. And the crawfish nook, which I saw a little while ago. So, stocked up on the Crush 50. X. Ready for fall. We're getting into the fall now. It was, I got on the lake this morning, it was 52 degrees. Uh, water was 72 degrees. So, you know, we are definitely into that fall transition. So, Quit talking, just keep unboxing. Let's see, we got another six cents. Let's see what we got here. My six cents scissors, they're great. They cut all the different lines I use well. Okay. All right, I know what video this is from. <laughs> uh, the top water hitters. Uh, this is the catwalk I was telling you about. A great top water bait uh, before we get into the cranking season. Uh, that's a good looking bait. It's got three good nickel sharp plated hooks. 3D gills on the side, and it walks good. I've got this bait already. I just ordered a backup, because I almost lost it last time I had it. And uh, so you always gotta have two or three in the boat for backup, or on your, your tackle wall. Uh, 
right, I also got that color in the speed wake, which this bait I haven't fished with yet. So, and it was back in stock. So I ordered some more of it. Uh, but the, the speed wake, it runs real shallow across the top and basically like a top water boat, but it does have the bill on the front of it. I'm gonna keep going. Another catwalk. This is in the Salmon Shad. I think that's what it says. Excuse me. Sensory Shad color. Got a, a shad color reflected with all the different colors. I'm just going to just keep going because we got too much to get into. Got Speed Wake in the brim color. Another bone reactor got the catwalk and the blue gilla. Can't wait to give that a try because I have a lot of blue gill in the lake I fish more than I do. Uh, we got as many shad as that. It's another in the shad color. I always get multiple. I kind of got three in the bone. <laughs> I like that bone reactor. This is a shad color in the catwalk and of course another blue gilla. Got to have a backup and a speed wake, another speed wake in the bluegill. So, like I said, I'm gonna burn through these. We got a lot to open, and the reason I'm going ahead and opening it is because I'm ready to fish with it. I've been out of the game for a month. Let's see. This is a big box for six cents. I have no idea what this one is. Really, I haven't had any idea what it is. Now when I open, I remember it. But, this is a lot of something. Okay. I don't remember. Oh, okay, I do remember. Uh, Cause I got a couple of new rods, three or four new rods over the past month. I had to order some more. Six cents or rod covers. And I'm gonna tell y'all what, if you've had the, I'm gonna stop a minute and talk about these because the most awesome, I don't see, I think I even just threw them away. I gave some to my boathouse neighbor, but I don't have any more of the other ones. But you know what I'm talking about, that nylon mesh that looks like the old Chinese uh, bracelets we used to put on in, in school and your fingers get stuck, that material. Everything in the boat gets hung on it, your rod gets hung in it, your lures get hung in it. Not with these. The six cents come up. Let's see if I can get a little closer to show you these. They came up with these and it's all I have in my boat now. Uh, plus, Justin Royal is right. I mean, these things have a yeah, have an awesome smell and like newness smell to it. Kind of like a new car. But I can't quite figure out what it reminds me of, but I always like the smell of them. Weird, huh? But trust me, if you order one, open it. You'll see what I'm talking about. But they are more of a, almost like a, reminds me of a wetsuit, you know, diving, skin diving, you know, a diving wetsuit. That's what it reminds me of. Nothing gets hung on it. Uh, it's flexible, it stretches, your string is adjustable to hook around your reel or whatever part it comes closest to, to keeping it snug on your rod. Highly recommend these. They're not expensive. A couple of dollars more than them old cheap plastic ones that everything in the world, I mean, I've had to cut lures out of those, not these. They're on every one of my rocks. Uh, so I had to order a few extra. And so now we're stocked up on those. What else is in here? Whew. Oh, okay. This, I'll go ahead and get all these out because they're all the same thing. When the Vega Frog first come out, some of the colors they were coming out a little bit at a time. And when I first got one, I only got one white. And I've got a video coming 
where we caught a bunch of bass and nice bass, largemouth bass on the white. Uh, I talked to one of my buddies, another YouTuber. Uh, in fact, I even called him from the lake when I, I had a black Vega and a white Vega and it was overcast that day. And I just gave him a little text shout out and uh, he texted me back and we kind of chatted a little bit. But uh, the whites, what I went with that day, even though it was overcast, a lot of people will go with a, a black frog, but I went with a white frog upon Darian Craig's suggestion. And uh, you'll see that up and coming video. Uh, had some fun breaking in my first very first bass on the Vega Frog was five and a half pounds uh, up in two foot of water. Absolute blast. Uh, but so anyway, I only had one. So when they came out on the site, you can go to their site. At, uh, uh, you could go to their site and if they're out of an item, uh, you can click on it at sixcentsfishing.com. If they're out of an item, you can click on it and it'll email you when you get it. Well, when I was sick, laid up, I got my email that the white fog was back in stock. So it's kind of what I do. And in that way, I'm set. I don't have to worry about ordering it. So during that same time, <laughs> uh, the Curve 55 came back in stock and with some new awesome colors and I, I just i dove right in uh there are so many this video is gonna be so long uh the curve 55 now it does crank down it's got hey, let me go ahead and rip one out i'll just show you one and then show you the other colors the curve 55 i, I kind of call it like a finesse crankbait it's much smaller with the same handcrafted, hand-painted look of all their quality lures that you get. But this one has the bigger bill than the, uh, the, the Crush 50X we were talking about. So naturally, it dives deeper. This is, goes five to nine feet, and the Crush 50 that we were talking about earlier, the X, is two to three feet. So to get in a little deeper water, and it, but you're not in real deep water. This is what I like to use. Uh, the Curve 55 comes in so many different colors, so you can kind of find the one that that does the job for you. Uh, but as again, it's the same thing. I don't know if the GoPro is doing this justice, but uh, the coloring is just, it, it looks like somebody sat there and hand painted these lures. Uh, and the quality, they hold up good. Uh, I've, I've got some that I've used six months and still use it. Uh, and, and then of course naturally you use, lose one from time to time. But the Crush 55 is another go-to for me. Um, you know, I'm a crank crankbait fanatic. I, you know, I love reaction baits, you know, where you're fishing and you get a, you make the fish react. The, the bass is a predator and that bait coming by real quick surprises him even if he's not hungry they lash out at it because they're a predator they're gonna they're gonna take something that looks easy to get but i got several new colors some of these colors they had some of them are new uh i'll show you a few of them this is the mud bug red oh uh, we got the delta crawl so you can get all the different variations of the red and orange. Another Delta Crawl. Always got to get multiple of each one. Another Delta Crawl. I'm Rick. This is another Mud Bug Red. Trying to see if I got. Okay, this is the Bluegill Fire. Uh, I will take that out. Got a lot of bluegill in our lake. Take a look at this bait. Tell you what I like about this. If you, if, you, if you catch a bluegill and hold it up this bait, the resemblance, you know, and the, and the, the different bluegill, of course, in different lakes, different patterns, 
different kind, perch, bluegill, but this thing in the water <laughs> is awesome. They are still. Do you hear that? What is that? I gotta check that out. Something just annihilated something over there. Okay, sorry for the interruption, but hey, bass fisherman's here's three, four, five pound bass blowing up on them. With all the bait fish, you gotta go give it a try. Uh, I don't know if y'all could hear that when I was talking about the, the curve. right over on the other side of my boathouse and between the other boathouse. I mean, a fish blowed up. It sounded like it hit the side of the boathouse, literally. Uh, but then when I threw my fluke out there and was pulling it back through, this bait fish just scattered everywhere. So he must have come up in there, got him some bait and went out. Uh -huh. But I had to throw a couple of times. Sorry about that. But that would have been real cool if I could have caught it on him. Where was I? Curve unboxing. So to get on into it, this is the other color I want to try. Cause we had the brown color, um, and I showed you this a little bit ago. The crackle crawl. Uh, this one, crawl bomb. It has a. I'm, I'm gonna open that one. It has a lot of sparkle to it. So I think on a good sunny day in the clear water, like the water's clearing up now, uh, it's got like a gold sparkle with them black zebra stripes and that good old orange belly. I think that would be a real good crawfish imitator. Uh, we'll see. Uh, get this box back up. But that's what's all in this box was some curves. Put all of them back in there. And the Vega Frog. You got a spot. Where's the spot for the frogs? Here. Down below. So we gotta put us a new peg for the white. And we'll be good to go there. And don't forget the rod covers. I promise you, you won't go to no other. And, mm, plus they smell divine. I need to make a candle out of that scent. Um, all right, let's keep going. Oh, let's see. This one is real heavy and it's not a six cents box. Uh, I know what it is. If you'll remember <clears throat> some of my previous videos, the, the disco green and the fluke, 
In fact, that's what I just threw. Uh, I caught some fish on that this morning. Um, when you when you got bass chasing shad out in deep water, middle of the lake, they start rounding stuff up. You can't go wrong here. Uh, that is absolutely some of the funnest fishing. Another thing that Justin Royal, uh, I, you know, I can't thank him enough. Big shout out to him. Introduced me to that bait in his YouTube videos. And um, it, he calls it the Disco Biscuit. It's a funny story. So me and a couple of friends, we're looking for the Disco Biscuit in the store. <laughs> but it's a Disco Green, if you want to know. Uh, it's hard to find with all this crazy world we live in and, and shipping and everything. Uh, so I did find a, a spot on the internet and basically what I did is stocked up because you can find them in our local stores and online everybody was out. I think that's, I did buy a, I found a I bought this site out on the Disco Green because I just, I like that color and had 100% great results with it. Uh, but I did find a Disco Violet. So that instead of the green, it has a little bit of violet color to it. Uh, but fantastic bait. Uh, basically what I did is stocked up and I think that's all that's in here. Yep, so those got to go on the tackle wall and we'll get them hooked up because I was down to this bag and one other up there. So the, the, the downside to these lures, you know, I'll, I'll go ahead and the reason you say, well, guy, why are you buy so many? Uh, you catch a fish, you might can catch one or two fish with it, but they, they tear real easy. They're real soft plastic. But that's why they keep hitting it. Uh, you know, it, 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 if they don't feel the hook, uh, uh, I caught a fish this morning. He literally hit it three times. I thought I'd lost my touch. Reeling it back, I was working it. Uh, he just twitched it a little bit, let it sink, twitch it a little bit. It looks like a wounded shad. He hit it three times and I jerked, you know, and, and missed him. And he hit it a fourth time and I caught him. Uh, and I just can't tell you when they're in the mood, they will chase this all the way back to the boat till you hook them. Uh, so I don't have to worry about running out of that. Let's see, uh, getting down to the bottom. I know I went through these fast. I didn't show a lot of baits, but uh, I didn't want it to be too long. And, but I did want to show you what I'm fishing with and kind of give you some helps and tips on where to order these, how to save some money. <laughs> hey, forgot all about uh, September's, you know what, the Super Six Sack, premium. Well, there's probably, uh, there's probably already, I'm so laid into it, I'm not gonna spend a lot of time into it because there's probably already a bunch of, in fact, I know a couple of YouTubers that I've watched have already had some unboxings of it, so, you know, Spoiler alert, I already know what's in here because I watched Justin Justin Royal open his. Uh, but I will go through them because that brings me back to our giveaway. Uh, for those who watched this Six Sense unpacking when we had a lot of crankbaits, I had a, a contest where you, you know, subscribe to the channel, which by the way, if you want to see future contents, subscribe to our channel now. And if you've liked what you've seen, give us a thumbs up and uh, hit the notification bell so you'll know when our future videos are coming out. You'll be notified. Uh, just like the winner of this Sixth Sense giveaway, um, you'll get notified of this video and they won. So we had, I, I went through the, all you got to do is comment when I have a giveaway, just comment uh it, below anything that you'd like that gets you registered into the contest as long as you're subscribed to the video and you've liked the video uh, uh leave a comment then we do the random selector into the comments and it just randomly picks in, any comment but if you didn't leave a comment then you won't get picked even if you liked it so you gotta leave a comment but without further ado 
let's pick the winner for the for the super six cents super sack premium monthly subscription where I'm gonna load this bag with all the crankbaits as I promised new off the wall the ones I'm catching them on it's six cents so we're gonna put six baits in it so let's let's draw for the winner right now we'll go through our random selector we'll pull up the comments on that video Click on the random selector and Life of Murphy's Outdoor Channel. Way to go, Life of Murphy. In fact, they said, great giveaway. We are new to the channel. So, you know, that's great. His comment uh, was letting me know he's new to the channel and the random selector has selected them as the winner of this bag. But right now it's empty. So if we can do this, I don't know if you'll be able to see, but I'm going to go to the tackle wall and get your crankbaits now. Let's go. All right, so I know I promised the one I've been catching all my bass on during that pre-fall transition was the Cloud9 C10 series in the citrus candy. So, woo, M1 goes. You know, that's a great bait and it's the one that you'll use the most. So let's make sure if you lose it, you have another. I'm gonna include two of them because that's, that's the number one, in my opinion, the color. Uh, we're gonna get the new Speedway. That's a brand new lure. It just came out this year. So you're gonna get that included as well. This one is in the wake shad. So that's three. Uh, let's get let's get you the magnum. I promise the magnum. And a cloud nine. The C20 in the Cloud9, that's a deep diver, 22 feet. That's number four. And you gotta have a Magnum. Uh, this Magnum uh, is, what color is it? The Lavender Citrus. This is a hard to get lure going in the box. That is how many? Five, six, two, three, four, five, and one more. I'll tell you what, let's go with, since I was talking so much about the, one of my favorites in the crush. color yeah crush 50 that's number six so there you go just uh you can dm me or private message me on facebook south georgia bassin uh on instagram at south georgia bassin just send me your uh, address and you got a cloud nine crush 50 Another Cloud9 C20, the Speed Wake, and two of the, my favorite, uh, two of the, the C10 and the Citrus Candy. You've seen me catch them on those. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and include you too, because if you lose one, you'll be sad. So I'm going to have you two of those in there. So Life of Murphy. DM me address and these will go out to you on Monday. So uh, appreciate you playing and we'll have another contest. So remember, hit the notification bell, subscribe. You'll get the next chance to win a super six sack. So moving along, 
Congratulations, man, and, and that's great. The first time to the channel, person one. Oh, we got another box down here. This is from Six Sense. All right, where my scissors go? We are just. This is cool. This is fun. Oh, we gotta get. Wait a minute. We didn't unbox the. Uh, which y'all probably already seen a September. But let's let's unpack it anyway, because I know what's in here. I'm kind of excited about one of them. We got the Movement 80 and the Blue True Shad. We've got a flat. These are the 75X. You know I fish with them. I got some up on the tackle wall there. I don't have this color though. That's thread fin shad. Like I said, I'm not gonna open up these because they're getting too long. Hey, another hybrid jig, which I, which I, <clears throat> I'm still a little shaky from that bass hitting out there. Ah, wish I could have caught him. That'd been cool. Uh, hybrid jig. I don't have. I've only got one hybrid jig on the wall. The rest swim jigs, which you know I love fishing with too. Oh, okay, man. The Quake 70 and the uh, orange sunfish. Now that is a good looking color. And I've got another Crush 100. I like the Crush 100 when I'm looking for, you know, sometimes I catch a little larger fish. I, I go up from the, the, the 55. And just so, I don't know if you'll know, I mean the 50, I'll go up from the Crush 50. You can tell the size of the baits. Uh, if, if, I, if I'm targeting a little bit, you know, big fish will hit a small bait. You know, there's, there's no argument there. But I tend to, will lean toward this if, I, if I'm, the fishing's slow, and, but I'm catching larger fish. So anyway, that's cool. I need that color. And then they always send you some soft baits. This is the uh, Divine Shaky Worm and the Grass Candy. Man, the Grass Candy is an awesome color. I use it in the crawl up there, the Grass Candy. And can't never have enough of the swim baits. These are the 3.2 in the Electric Shiner. Uh, I'll use this along with the fluke, I'll throw these or swim and put them on a swim jig or just straight hook the smaller ones with the three alt and the four inch, I do a four alt hook on. But that's the, the uh, premium last month, which you've probably already seen to somebody. But can't stress that, you know, you get baits that you use. That's the, uh, the lipless, the Quake 70, which I haven't had a chance to fish with much. I only have one of those. So now I've got a, a good, color that I like in that uh, so there you go super sack premium monthly subscription was mixed in with all this all right we have one more six cents box I really really don't know what's in this one uh, I thought that was I remember ordering all that Ah, uh, okay. Now I remember. It's funny when you see them, you remember. These are some terminal tackle I bought uh, because they were out of them. And I got notified, like I said, you click on that notify me and you give them your email address and they'll just notify you when that one item comes back to them. And that was their uh, pitch black tungsten weights. They're very popular. They sell out as soon as they get them. So uh, I got four packs of those. Uh, and, and these, I believe, let's see. Yeah, I believe these are the quarter ounce, the, which is the, the smaller. They have a lot of half ounce and one ounce that keep this in stock. Uh, but where I fish, I don't have a lot of real deep water. So I don't need those heavier weights out on deep ledges that a lot of these other guys have to have them but and, and, and so i stocked up on those I, I needed those then the rest in this box is my all-time favorite 
the six cents uh, jigs, divine six cents divine jigs. Uh, I got them in different colors and different weights. Uh, I was trying to get the lighter weight because where I'm throwing this flute and the swim jig, uh, it's not real, real deep. So I don't, I, I like it to go down slow and work it. I don't like it to just drop fast. I, I like it to get in there when they're suspended. So uh, I use the eighth ounce. That's my favorite uh, in the different colors. Uh, you know, this is the sun gill. And then we have the different, I don't know if you can see them on that whole row there, the divine swim baits uh, in different lengths, different colors. Uh, I needed to stock up on, on the jig heads. Uh, and I've got plenty of the, the swim bait, but not the, just the regular jig heads so that I can pop it and work it up and down like I do the fluke. And, and just another alternative, this depends on the fish, fish's mood. So we got that. Uh, then the moment I've been waiting for. Justin Royal, I, I say that name a lot because I've been watching him a lot. Uh, he switched over completely to six cents rods. Uh, which I've been in a gradual phase of doing that. So let's break into this and then I'll explain my reasoning. If you watched my last rod unboxing, I just did a whole unboxing on that, but I'm trying to do all this in one. This is gonna be a long video, but I'm ready to use all this stuff and I, I like to open it live, just, just like I'm with you. So, as usual, six cents rods come in a PVC tube, uh, and they won't be damaged. Whew. And they put several packing protectors. Six cents tape. You gotta love it. Let's see if I can get into the play on every one of them. Looks like I can. That's cool. Alright, so got all that off. I don't know which end you're supposed to open this from. This end. Velcro tab, but you could use this <clears throat> rod protector, but I'm not because I love the real rod protector. So they must have some more. Man, this thing is a well protected. I'm gonna try. Let's see, it keeps hanging up. Here we go. It's always the secret to getting a rod unpacked. Whoo, man. I love this handle. I've been jealous watching JR fish with those. They look so comfortable to fish with. Now I see why. Man. It's got the little crown for the the reel to go on there. This is their sensory lineup, the 7.3 Heavy. Well, the reason I got this rod, not just because somebody uses it, because, but he does, but because the way he went into describing why he uses it, and that's the reason I did. It's a seven foot three, so you got a little bit of length, but not a real long rod and not a too short rod. For setting that hook, I'm going to be using this for my divine uh, swim swim jig rod. Uh, it's heavy because it's got some backbone. You got to set that hook. You got to set that hook pretty good. So I like the heaviness of the tip. But man, this oh this rod feels good. I can see it. It's, it's pretty strong, pretty pretty solid. 
but has a little play in the tip. So, in the sensory, uh, it, it, as far as feeling that bait, that feeling that bite with the swim jig is crucial. Uh, and, and knowing that it's a fish, because you got to set the hook with the swim jig. If you're, you know, not with the with the swim jig, you've got the weedless guard in there so you've got to make sure and pull down hard let that hook get set good so this i can't wait to get out doing some swim jig fishing i'm gonna pair it up i didn't have a reel that and i did something that i don't normally do uh, i've already unboxed this i've already unboxed this it's a shimano Reel, which I've about almost got off Shimano. I still have some lose, but uh, I've watched uh, Tim Little and Matt Allen on tacticalbassin.com. Their links on the side as well. They do a lot of gear review uh, and tackle review, more so than some of the other YouTubers I watch. So that's that's pretty much the the three or four that I watch. Uh, I, my, their link is on my homepage uh, for the four I watch, just so you know where I get this information, where I learn this information, and combine it with the information that I've learned over uh, the years of fishing in South Georgia. And I, I combine some of their information with it, but uh, uh, Darian Craig on uh, Darian is Fishing, and Justin Royal, uh, and then of course tacticalbassin.com a big shout out to Matt and Tim in fact they've just moved from California over here kind of to the south uh, I believe they're in Kentucky or Tennessee now um, and then also Milliken Fishing I've been watching them as well very entertaining now he's more up north uh, in fact watched them camp out and sleep on a pond of ice and catch fish and cook them in their tent uh, Pretty, pretty funny, but just weird, you know, awesome. There's so many that's kind of different fishing throughout the whole U.S. and around the world, but a lot of all this stuff still applies to anywhere you fish. So, um, anyway, I'm gonna combine that rod with this reel, which I would say uh, I got my free reel cover with it, Tackle Warehouse. Um, this would be the most high-end reel I've got. I've got some some of the Karata DCs. I haven't fished with this reel, but it's awesome looking. It feels good. Is a four hundred and something dollar reel better than a two hundred and something dollar reel or ninety dollar reel? I would have to say that I have had better luck with my. Uh, Corrados, the DC model, the Shimano DCs. Uh, and then I have them in the SLX, which is the, the more cheaper, not cheaper, but less expensive. Uh, $180, $190 range. Uh, I'll have to say, the quality is there. And if you're fishing a lot, like I do, um it, it, you can't you, you wear wheels out and they start to have problems not to say these won't but these are easy to take care of the way they come apart you can clean them and oil them yourself uh but i haven't fished with one of these yet but that's what i got to pair up oh wow if nothing else this is gonna look good even if it don't work good uh this reel matches this rod like this is like a perfect god this looks awesome oh and it feels good this reel is small you can palm it and then on this rod and the pad and the cushions there on my fingers man i'm ready to stop this and just go put some line on this and go try it out but that'll be our next video there you go uh, this, uh, I'll turn it around where you can read everything. I'm crammed in the boathouse here. This is the Sixth Sense 
sensory seven foot three heavy combined with that bad shimano so we'll find out i'll i'll go into more detail on the reel uh it's got some settings i've got to learn this is a new reel to me uh <laughs> that sure looks good i can't wait so wow what an unboxing uh it's time to put all this on the tackle wall and uh take a break <laughs> thanks for watching uh if you stayed this long sorry it was long but i had a lot of unboxing to do and it seems a lot of people have liked the unboxing seeing the new baits the new colors the the different stuff that's available now uh sixcentsfishing.com you can use jr10 for the win a jr10 code for and save you uh 10 you can use darian craig's code dc10 uh and if you're not subscribed to the monthly make sure and check that out they also have a code for that on their site where you they'll save save you 10 bucks off your first one so you can get 50 60 dollars worth of lures coming to your house on the first shipment for like 24 23 dollars and there thereafter it's like 32 dollars a month but you get quality baits every month and i can't say enough and i get the premium back uh because then you get the 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 lures that are used the most the most popular and the newest when they come out with a new one they'll even pop a new one in here when they could put it on the site and sell it for more so shout out six cents and congratulations to life of murphy's outdoor channel who was a first subscriber to our channel on the subscribe on the uh, giveaway video so don't forget dm me your message uh, your address and your stuff will be on your way and everybody else if you're not subscribed go ahead hit the subscribe button give us a thumbs up on this video sorry it was so long uh but uh, give us a thumbs up Subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you'll need to be notified because we're going to be doing another giveaway. Got a lot of stuff here to unbox. Uh, I'm going to take another selection. We'll try to figure out what we're going to give away off the tackle wall back here and uh, have another giveaway. So thanks for watching and see you soon.